going on YouTube. So, I haven't kept up with the round count on this gun, but I want to say it's near a thousand rounds. As y'all know, I shoot the hell out of this gun. This gun's very dirty, but it's, it's clear. I'm not going to clean the barrel, and that's only because... I'm not going to clean the barrel because, I mean, it's an AK. It doesn't require much maintenance. Now, as you can see, this, this gun is very, very... Very dirty. Now you can see some pieces of metal missing, and I'm just gonna clean it up just to see, you know, where we are, how it's holding up, as far as the metal pieces in. And here you can see it's had its fair share of ammo. Do it. All right. We're gonna start by cleaning this. I'm looking for any signs of wear before I clean it. And after I clean. Just focus this. Yeah, she's dirty. <laughs> I mean, I could take this whole thing down, take this out in the frying pan, but I mean, like I said, it's an AK. Now, as y'all know, this is what I use. You, you're about to see how fast this, this works. And yeah, you don't have to, you don't have to put a lot. I know it might look a lot, but it's not. And you really don't even have to wait for this to, you know, attack, because it, it bites right off. I'm about to show you. We're just going to do that front part. I mean, really, you, after a few hundred rounds, you, you probably want to let it, you know, penetrate. But nobody wants to wait on that. And like I said, there's some built up carbon on this thing, so I'm probably gonna have to use another brush. As you can see, I'm probably gonna have to let that sit. So that's what I'm gonna do. Like I said, I got a few, I'm probably near a thousand rounds in this gun. So I'm gonna let that sit. Go get y'all something, I'm telling you. It, 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 it works miracles. And I'm, like I said, I'm gonna do the same thing in here too. And I can take all this out, but like I said, it's an AK, you don't, you don't gotta do all that. I'm not really too worried about this, the back of the gun, because, I mean, that's not affecting anything back here. I don't really baby my guns, so. You're gonna see them dirty, especially the AKs. They can take, they can take a beating. I'm gonna let that sit, and I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, guys, we're back. I'll let this sit for a little bit. As you can see, I wish it focuses. I had to grab it stronger. I was using the nylon brush. Now in here we can use an nylon stock. I'm really surprised what this is going to look like once I clean it all up. I'm already starting to see some wear. I'm going to pause this and then show you guys the results. Okay, guys, we're back. So as you can see, I, like I said, I haven't kept up with the round count. I want to say it's near 1,000. Uh, you want to see some crazy looking. Let's 
It's definitely wearing tear on this. It's gonna look ashy because I just sprayed the uh, solvent on there. Yeah. But I told you guys I was gonna shoot the hell out of it. Visco. So like I said, I didn't clean this back. There's anything past this back here. But you can see. You can see some there. Uh, this barrel is chrome molly, so I'm pretty sure you can shoot close around with this thing. So that's why it's a little shiny. But yeah, I've shot the hell out of this thing. But I just cleaned it just to see the wear and tear on it. How is it holding up? I didn't fully clean this gun. I'm just going to chop it up now. <laughs> it's an AK. You don't have to do that. But yeah, guys, so it's been some land challenge thing. You're starting to see somebody finish wear off on it. And that's why I run some of the Draco so hard to show you guys the after effects. This is what a lot of people don't show you. But that seems to be holding up though. Now it's time to load this bad boy up. This is the way I'm using, guys. Make sure y'all can see. You don't have to use much of this oil. So you're going to see me like put a little dabs because you don't need a lot of this oil because it's dirty. It's hot period oil. So. You know what that means? You go back to school. Like I said, I, I run the hell out of this gun at the range, and this oil will still be on all the parts. Right. A lot of people don't know, you know where to hit it on their gun. But all of this is gonna uh, mix together anyway, so it's not gonna really make a difference if you do or don't get every spot because it's gonna work its way there anyway. Mm -hmm. I sometimes like to uh, put something up there, but I'm not gonna do it. Now. You see how Ashley's gun looks right now on the outside, right? You will be very surprised. It makes it non ashy again. <laughs> see? I don't know. It's weird. Right? But. There. Don't, don't even say nothing. I'm going to say something. I just realized, like, I shot this gun a hell of times. The way half of this finish is, like, it's holding up. It's definitely holding up, but I shoot this gun way too much. I hate this gun. But it's cool, because I love it. That's how you do it. This is to conclude the Visco clean. Have a terrible rock, I'd like to say, guys. Uh, let me know what you think. Put your on it. Comment below.